defenses are off the charts. Our troops can outfight any Alliance soldier. Roll it out. I want all troopers fitted with implants before the Reapers arrive. I'm still concerned about us losing control of our forces. Some of them are already hearing voices. When our work as Sanctuary pays off, the only voice they'll be hearing is ours. So, the, the upgrades he's made to the Cerberus troops does, in fact, make them vulnerable to indoctrination and, and vulnerable to being controlled by the Reapers. But then he's saying that the work of Sanctuary allows them to, to make their own Reaper signal, and you know, make their own control signal, so then he can control his own guys. I still don't understand how that's even going to work, because even if you have a signal that you can control, there's like thousands of Reapers out there, and they are all broadcasting. Like, how, how is the elusive man ever going to maintain control over an army? Like, can you broadcast a signal more strongly than, than a thousand Reapers on the other side? It seems highly unlikely, doesn't it? Sir, you wanted my opinion on this. It's too dangerous. No, we're close. Sanctuary was a success. We can control Reaper forces. Everything we've been fighting for, every sacrifice we've made, it's about to pay off. We can't lose you, sir. Humanity needs your mind, and they need it intact. I understand the danger, Janna. That's why I'm trusting you with this. As long as you're here, I know you'll keep me in line. I'm holding you to that, sir. Okay. Begin the procedure. No anesthetic. Computer, end recording. And then he implants himself. And then he implants himself. And then keep in mind what he's doing too, like all this time he's trying to control. He's, he wants to control other people, he wants to control the Reapers, he wants to control the Council, he wants to control the other other species. And that's that, remember how I just said before? Like the, the renegade option is just to kind of control and dominate and force your will onto others, that, that's the renegade path throughout the three games. Whereas the Paragon option is to you know, convince people to work together, you know, convince people to, to, you know, be better, basically. You use diplomacy to, you know, negotiate uh, preferable solutions instead of, you know, dominating and controlling other people. So there you go. I believe that's all the story we're gonna get at the Cerberus base. Yep. Also, what is this room? Not sure why this is like that. I guess it's some sort of isolation thing? This is it. Stay sharp, everyone. I wouldn't mind an office like this. It's a pretty nice office. Shepard, you're in my chair. This chair's about the only damn thing you have left. Cerberus is finished. On the contrary, we have achieved everything I ever imagined. Almost everything. Yeah. We all saw what you accomplished on Sanctuary. But it's not the same as controlling a Reaper. A significant hurdle. But thanks to the Prothean VI, I have what I need to make it a reality. The Catalyst. Yes. 
What is the Catalyst, and how exactly will it help you control the Reapers? You'll have to ask the B.I. yourself. I'm done helping you. When did you start? You think because I'm willing to use the enemy's tactics that they're no longer my enemy? Everything, Shepard, everything I've done has uplifted humanity. Not only above other species in our galaxy, but over the Reapers. Uplifted humanity? Uplifted humanity. All I see are a lot of dead people. You're a mass murderer. That's all you are. If you're willing to do everything it takes, then hand over the catalyst. With the crucible, we can end this. It's not that simple. It is. It is that simple. We are fighting each other while the Reapers occupy Earth. It's time to stop. Your idealism is admirable, Shepard. But in the end, our goals are simply too disparate. I believe destroying the Reapers would be the worst mistake we could ever make. And nothing you can say will ever convince me otherwise. Even with Cerberus in ruins, you still think you can do this your way. I'd expect you to say that. You never truly believed in us. Cerberus isn't just an organization or the people behind it. Cerberus is an idea. That idea is not so easily destroyed. Besides, I've already acquired what you're looking for. Edie, I've almost got it. Edie, I'm surprised at you, working so hard to bring about the Reaper's destruction. Don't listen to him. You could have destroyed Eva's body, but instead, you chose to control it. It was necessary. My point, exactly. I've got it. Security breach detected. Enjoy your little chat, but don't overstay your welcome. You are attempting to recover me from indoctrinated forces? Yes. I need to know what the catalyst is. Security protocols have been overridden. I will comply. The catalyst enhances dark energy transmissions and coordinates the entire mass relay network. In your cycle, it is known as the Citadel. What? The Catalyst is the Citadel. The Catalyst is the Citadel. Dun dun dun! Plot twist. Also, back to Edie. Well, first of all, Edie did not kill anyone to get that body. Although, well, I guess she killed Eva. I think Eva was also an AI. Not sure how complete an AI she was. Although, if they managed to fit her entire program onto the body itself, then it can't be a very big AI. So, you know, so, so Edie didn't kill a lot of people to get that body. And secondly, Edie doesn't think that she's saving all of humanity by doing it. You know? I mean, we, we do use Reaper technologies. We just don't use it to murder countless people. <laughs> like the elusive man does. And we're not doing it to... to dominate them. Like, Edie didn't take over the body to enslave other people. She took over the body after destroying Eva because Eva was trying to uh, fight back against um, Edie trying to hack her brain and all that. You know, like, it's, it's the intent. It's the intent, I mean... Yeah, I mean, it's not... It's not just what you do, it's also how you do it, and why you do it. Although, I mean, it's also what you do, but it's not always, it's not just what you do. It's also why you do it and how you do it. Anyway, let's, let's go back to this. Dun dun dun, the Citadel is the catalyst. So the Crucible and Citadel together can stop the Reapers. That is correct. But the Citadel was built by the Reapers. The plans for the Crucible were passed down to us from the previous cycle, and countless cycles before that. At some point, it is difficult to pinpoint when. The Crucible plans were adapted to incorporate the use of the Catalyst. Presumably, the Crucible was not sufficiently powerful to defeat the Reapers. So we used their own technology against them? Precisely. Hmm. Why couldn't you tell me this before? 
It was feared that if the Reapers were aware of the Catalyst's intended use, they would retake control of it. I am programmed to withhold that information until the Crucible is complete. It's as ready as it's gonna be. Let's get it to the Citadel. That may no longer be possible. Why not? The one who broke through my security protocols, the one you call the Elusive Man, has fled to the Citadel and informed the Reapers of our purposes. Damn it! Then the Citadel is in danger. The Reapers will take control of it. They already have. The Citadel has been moved to the Reaper-controlled space. Moved? To where? To the system you refer to as Soul. Earth. Correct. The Reaper forces will now consolidate power around the Catalyst and protect it at all costs. The odds of accessing it are remote. Don't count us out yet. We've come this far, and we'll finish this. We'll get the Crucible to Earth. I hope you find success. Edie, get me Hackett. He needs... Oh, hi. This guy. Not so fast. You. He did warn you not to overstay your welcome. Bro, you wear a dress and you dance around. And you punch the ground, too. That's not... Can I punch him? Where is he? Oh, he's gone. This is better than death. More All you're doing is making human. All you're doing is prancing around in a skirt, bro. Alright, let's use our skills. Bro, you're not evolving anything. You don't understand anything about evolution. Stop pretending like you know what you're talking about. Okay, I, I really should... Actually, maybe I should just... Actually, no, I need to get, get in cover. No, no. We're not done yet. You're still wearing a skirt, Kai Lang. Um... Does that work on them? I need to get behind this cover here. Alright, so now we have Nemesis. What to do about them? <laughs> All this trash talking. Uh, does that work on him? No, it doesn't work on him. Um. Hmm. Can my squadmates please kill him? Oh, I can use this incinerate. And um, can I sh 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 do that? And he's dead. Sometimes you get lucky and you kill him easily. Sometimes you get unlucky and you just get shot by a nemesis two or three times and you just die. So that combat's a little bit hit and miss sometimes. Even on the highest difficulty, sometimes you get lucky and sometimes you don't. Bro, just lie down. How can you not hear him? He's making so much noise. Sure, you can. Go on. Huh? That was for thing, you son of a bitch. So much for your upgrades, fool. The citadel is in position. The reapers are preparing to complete their harvest of your species. I'll stop them. It is too late. I recommend investigating. I'll stop them. Oh, oops! I was meant to wait for this for the next one. Never mind. Doesn't really matter, I don't think. Oh wow! Look at that! It's a really big cuttlefish. Oh no, that's the um, citadel. 
closed above Earth. Barely. I assume you've heard about the Citadel. Just now. Do we know what's going on? Why it's here? The Citadel is the catalyst. Thanks to the elusive man, the Reapers are now aware that we know. And so they moved it here to protect it? As far as I can tell. What does this mean for the Crucible? I'll talk to Hackett about that, but... It looks like our plan is even more desperate now. Agreed. I've got a team in London. The Reapers have been preparing for something here. Now, we know what for. We'll scout it out. Try to find out as much as we can. Roger that. Well, at least we'll be seeing you sooner rather than later. Yeah. Be careful, sir. You too, Shepard. Anderson out. So I think the idea is that the Reapers have pulled back and are protecting the, the Citadel. And also, all our fleets are here waiting to attack the Citadel as well. Wow, there's a lot of money. A lot of money right at the end of the game when you can't actually go to the Citadel anymore to buy things. Thanks game, thanks. Alright, so the Alliance... What do we What do we gain? Alright, so this is... Uh, what is this? Um, that's the previous game. And then the crew of the Normandy, both past and present, have bonded over their shore leave experiences and vented stress that could have otherwise damaged their mental focus. They will fight for Shepard or for one another with renewed zeal. So the party actually adds more points to the ship as well. 